Hey babes, uh, good morning. It's a couple of days later. I'm still trying to like be a good blogger, so excuse me for that. Also, excuse my shirt right here. I'm sure you've already seen where I got this beautiful shirt, the sleeping wear from. But if you haven't, I'm going to link that video up. So I just had my breakfast. Today, I am going on a date with my brother. Bringing him back to the channel just because of you guys. You really loved him, so why not? Why not? What? Some of you guys here, <laughs> a story for another day. We're going to one of the best places that I would recommend for the best food, the best wings ever. And this place is absolutely stunning. I can't wait to show you guys. As usual, I have to be the plug on the best places that you guys need to check out. And I just want to start working on my face. So guys, I am actually done with my makeup. I have already also like styled the wig. But guys, today I just wanted to be a little bit minimal on the look. Because of late, I'm just feeling the soft glam look. And I think I did it justice. Please tell me what you think about it. I don't want to run late. So let me show you my outfit real quick. And then we can go. Outfit of the day. I just made it to Mavonen. This is the place that I was telling you to come and check out because they are wings. They are wings. Trust me, you're going to love them when you come. So let me just enter. Guys, I just got back home and I am a little bit exhausted from the traffic and all that. But apart from that, I absolutely loved this place. I think the food is 100% amazing. You guys should definitely check them out. Just try and just tell me how you find the food, especially the wings, guys. Yeah, so please go there. Tell me how you find the place. Tell me if you love the food. I'm definitely just down to hear your reviews about the place. Let me do the norm. So now I'm in the bathroom. I went to take this makeup off. I got some new products which I showed you guys in the last vlog. So there's the foaming cleanser. There's also this toner that I want to just try out with you guys. But I have already used them. That's why I'm just showing you how they work on my face. Also got some coconut oil to just melt down the makeup. I also got this, the cotton pads and some new Castle's baby wipes. These ones, I love them because they are just like, they don't have the alcohol and everything. Okay, so I'm going to take the coconut oil first, just a little bit of that on my palm and wrap it, then massage it on my face. As you can see, it really like just takes off the makeup really easily, guys. But coconut oil is actually not good for your skin if you're leaving it because it can cause like the uh, acne, the breakouts. I'm going to take a wipe. Just let's start with one of it. And just wipe it gently, guys, but in an upward motion. That's the makeup. 
off my face so it's time for the fresh foaming cleanser and the good thing about this is that it removes makeup and impurities leaving the skin feeling clean and refreshed and it is paraben free so you just know that this will actually take off the remaining makeup then i'm still going to go in with the toner so it just a little goes a long way at much just rubbing it in and as you can see it doesn't foam that much but it does its job as you can see i've already rinsed it off and by the way it smells so good it has just a mental smell that makes you feel relaxed it's now time for the toner i really just like it because it takes away the remaining makeup and it helps like keep oily skin under control especially for anyone who goes through all this as you can see i even have a pimple right here but it makes me just feel so cool by the way so cool on my face really relaxed by the way and as you can see i don't have like any makeup traces it doesn't have like any so it means that the cleanser actually worked and that's the good thing about it my face really feels like really calm cool it's just refreshed i love how this toner just makes my face feel after using it i'm now going to take the moisturizer and it's really light by the way so if you are like having issues with acne I think this will actually work for you so nicely. I really love how light it is on my face. My skincare is done. It's been 30 plus minutes from the last time you were seeing me in the bathroom just doing my skincare. And guys, guess what your babe was like doing? I'm even embarrassed. I feel like I'm now going to be shifting to TikTok. So please follow my TikTok. How I've watched videos. I don't know. I just had to cut myself short because if I didn't, I wouldn't have done what I need to do. I was really like missing out on a lot. Let's just go recreate another recipe that I've just seen and I love. TikTok cooking with Rhoda Mina. Uh, let's try and see if we can make it trend, make it a slogan. And yeah, tell me if you're actually enjoying these cooking videos, guys. Let's go make some food. Once again, we are in the kitchen. I'm trying to make some condoms. And I, of course, will need some baking flour. I'm using a jar. Uh, one cup of that. There's also some yeast, smoked sausages, this ones. I won't be using the hot dog. Uh, sugar, of course. Two eggs, which are right here. And yeah, let's start mixing up all these things. We're just trying out if this TikTok hack will work. The butter is nice and thick. This is the consistency you want it to be. You don't want it to be too runny. I think this is just enough. Guys, after so many fail attempts, I am really proud of what I did. I finally made some good looking, they are just okay. They are not perfect, but they are good looking corn dogs. And I think these ones will be bangers. I should try out one of them right now, but they look really amazing. I can't believe I did this and it was just my first like time trying it out. But big up, big up to me. These things look so cute, guys. Time for a taste test. Let me taste what TikTok made me do. Mm. 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 I've never had an American corn dog, but this is a banger. Guys, please try this TikTok out and you're going to just thank TikTok for everything. It looks like I just discovered TikTok, but I've had it for a while. I just wasn't interested, as interested in it as I am right now. First shout out goes to Miss Ngoge, Turkana Empress, Judy Mugo, Rama Sharifa, Sisi Wanyeki, Velin Mumbi, Lavenda Kimani, Nancy Njeri, Anne Biu, Ashley Nolan, Camilo KS, 
and Empress Didi. Guys, I really appreciate you. To so be in the next shout out, all you have to do is comment down, like this video, subscribe to my channel, and wait for your shout out. It's just as simple as that. I'm hoping that you enjoyed this week's vlog. Hit that like, subscribe, comment yes let's continue supporting each other yeah guys that's all you have to do let me love you and leave you until next time i'm sending you love and light